With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, the problem states that a uniform cable of mass M and length L is placed on a horizontal surface such that one by nth part is hanging below the edge of the cable up to the surface. We have to find the work done will be what and these are the options. So let's understand the problem. This is a table on which a chain is placed such that if the total length is L, it's 1 by nth part is hanging. Right. So that means if this is the chain, L by n part is hanging and the remaining part which is L minus L by n is there in the on the table. Okay. So we have to find the work done. This is the initial situation. So we have to find the work done that uh, uh, one has to do in order to keep this hanging part back to the table. So if this is the initial situation final, we can say this whole table, a whole chain will be lying on the table itself. This is a final situation. Okay. Now, as we know, work done will be equals to the change in potential energy. Work done by the external agent will be equals to change in potential energy of the chain so that means u final minus u initial okay so we can take this level as the datum point so here the potential energy will be zero right now let's say the hanging uh, part of the chain has the mass is small m so we can replace its this part with its center of mass so here is the mass m and this is at the height what l by n is the total length so it would be at l by 2n right so this length is l by 2n correct so let's try to find out the value of u final minus u initial so finally the whole chain is on the table so that's why the final potential energy is zero and initially the m part is below the datum point okay so that's why its potential energy will be negative so minus of m into g into height height is what L by 2 1. So that would become minus of minus is positive mg into L by 2 1. Now all we have to find is the value of uh, small m okay, in terms of capital M. So for that we can use the uh, unitary method that means if L length has mass m so unit length must be having mass m by L right. So we have to find uh, the mass of the part L by 2 1 sorry L by n okay. So L by n will be having mass m by l into l by n which is capital m by n right so let's put this value here so that is capital m by n into g into l by 2 n so that will give us mg l by 2 n square right so this will be the work done and that is given to us in the option a okay i hope this helps you with the answer thank you for class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.